my friends, it's Miss Adrienne again. I am back because I wanted to read you guys another story with permission from Scholastic. This is a story that talks about a feeling. The feeling of being grumpy. Have you guys ever felt grumpy before? Grumpy is a feeling that makes your body kind of feel icky. It's a word that we use when we're not feeling very good. Maybe you could be feeling sad. Sometimes you might be feeling grumpy because you're feeling worried or maybe frustrated. You may be feeling a little bit angry. Those feelings can make our bodies not feel good. Sometimes I, when I am feeling one of those feelings, I say that I'm feeling grumpy because my body just does not feel good. And this is a story called Grumpy Pants. It is about a penguin who is feeling pretty grumpy. His body is not feeling good. But this is a story about how he's feeling and what he does to make himself feel better. The story's author is Claire Messer. She wrote the words in this story and she was also the illustrator of this story. That means that she drew the pictures. Let's get started and see how this penguin goes from feeling grumpy to feeling better. This is the title page. It says, Grumpy Pants. Words and Pictures by Claire Messer. Penguin was in a bad mood. A very bad mood. He didn't know why, and he didn't care. He stomped his feet all the way home. He pulled off his grumpy coat and kicked off his grumpy boots, but he was still grumpy. He tried to shake it off, but he was still grumpy. So he took off his grumpy overalls. Nope, still grumpy. Finally, he took off his grumpy underpants. I'm still grumpy, you know. Then the penguin took a deep breath. Can you guys take a deep breath with penguin? Breathe in through your nose. And he counted. One, two, three, So what is he doing to try and make himself feel better right now? He got himself undressed and it looks like he's taking, yeah, a bath. Do you think that's gonna help him feel better? Let's find out. The water was nice and cold. Penguin played with his duck. He hid underwater and made himself a bubble beard. Little by little, he was starting to feel much better. It was time to get out of the tub. He put on his favorite pajamas and he had a steaming cup of hot chocolate. He read his favorite book. He found his favorite teddy, and climbed into bed. As Penguin fell asleep, he knew that tomorrow would be a good day because all the grumpiness 
had been washed away. The end. So Penguin in this story did a couple things to help himself feel better. First, he took a bath. He played with some of his favorite toys, like his ducky or the bubbles in his bath. He found his favorite teddy bear and put on his favorite pajamas. He read his favorite book and climbed into bed to fall asleep. Now there are lots of things just like that that you guys can do when you are grumpy to help yourself feel better. One of my favorite ways to help myself feel better when I'm grumpy is I remember some of our breathing tools that we use at school. Do you guys remember those? One of my favorite ones is the star breathing. So what I want you guys to do this with me. Can you guys smile? Take a deep breath. And relax. I know right now when we're all not at school, sometimes we feel sad because we miss our friends, we miss our teachers. Just know that I miss you guys a lot too. And I hope that I can see you guys again real soon. Let's put our hands up and sing our goodbye song together. One, two, three. Goodbye, goodbye, I know I'll see you soon. Goodbye, goodbye, have a wonderful afternoon. I miss you. Have a good day.